Okay, working with saving PDFs from Photoshop. Here I have a uh, eight and a half by fourteen document, uh, just a legal size document, and I tried saving it. It's just simple text. I tried saving it as a PDF, and it came out to be thirteen megabytes, which is ridiculously large for a PDF, especially one with just text. Um, so I did a little research to find how to more efficiently do that. So that's what I'm gonna cover right now. So. Uh, First thing we're going to do is go to image, and uh, sorry you can't see that, just uh, it's the image tab, image size, and I'm going to drop this down from 300 pixels per inch down to 150. And uh, 150 should be plenty when you're talking about <coughs> uh, quality of, of the way it looks, especially when you just have text. If you're working with a really high quality image that you don't want to be reduced in quality at all, you may want to keep that at 300, but that's going to be a really rare uh, case in my mind. 150 should be plenty uh, pixels per inch. So, okay, and that's immediately going to drop down uh, that file to half size. It's not going to change the 8.5 by 14. <clears throat> it's just going to change the, uh, it takes out half the pixels of the document, so it's half the size. So that's number one. Next thing, I'm going to go to File. This is ready to save. File, Save As. And uh, drop this down, and Photoshop PDF is what I want. And this does not really matter right here as far as changing the file size. It doesn't do a whole lot, uh, if anything. So I'm just going to hit Save as a Photoshop PDF. And uh, that's fine right there. And this is going to be Smallest File Size Modified, which does not make it as small as Smallest File Size. Uh, I'm not sure why it does that, but we want to take that and make sure it's at smallest file size, not press quality. That will uh, <coughs> that will diminish the quality uh, from from what I've seen. But smallest file size will take it down a lot. The file size without changing the quality. So we'll leave it there. Again, this doesn't matter a whole lot for changing the uh, the file size. So I'm just going to hit save, and there it is. I'm going to go ahead and open that up there's my here's the original test file it's sitting at 15.1 megs as a Photoshop file typically will <coughs> um, and here we're under one megabyte for for that test file so that's about where we want to be and that's down from 13 megabytes I'll just go ahead and open this up so we can take a look at the quality um, it's still readable that's not that's not bad that's it's gonna be okay so there we go